Alex Marinelli. First off, congratulations. Huge win against Blair. You yep. got a win against Blair. You go out and you get some bonus points. Yep. Uh, pushing the takedowns. Top game looks like it's coming, but you're a hammer on your yep. feet. But what what is that experience like coming down to the final? And, and a guy who's not a state placer for you yet. Right. And Joey Sanchez winning the duel for you. Yeah, well, uh, that's huge. I mean, I told Joey from the start, I said, it's probably going to come down to you because he was last match. And I knew that, uh, you know, he, he had a decent guy, but I mean, I, I knew he could win. Uh, and I just didn't know if he would do it, you know, because sometimes you get on the score table you, or on the on the on the uh, paper it says that the guy's going to win, but it doesn't know. You don't know if he's going to go out there and do it. So I mean, that was huge for Joey. That was huge. They beat you last year in the duel. You won the Ironman last yeah. year, then they came back and beat you in the duel. Is this redemption for you guys? Yeah, I've, ever since I've been in high school, we've never beat Blair. So it's like. I beating Blair is, is huge. I mean, it's and, I, and it means a lot because I uh, Joey is pretty much my brother. I mean, he we've done everything together. I live with him uh, at and Graham, and he's he's I mean he's my brother to me. So it's like coming coming here and getting Joey to make varsity and and beating Blair for the win. It's like that's huge. That's huge for him. So that's great. Sin had two weeks. Yeah. What is the training cycle like? Because he says you train for four things. Yeah. Ironman, Blair, St. Ed's, State, State Tournament. Yep. What's the environment going to be like for next week? The same. Uh, you know, Coach Jordan's been telling us to get uncomfortable with our body. Get uncomfortable uh, because the other guy will be uncomfortable. Because if we're uncomfortable, then you know the guy's uncomfortable because we've been training so hard. We've been, you know, we, we want to push the pace, and that's what we're been, we've been trying to do in the room. You know, it's going to be the same training up to St. Ed's. Um, and we're gonna try to blow right through them and win the win the dual meet. And I mean, every every practice counts. You know, every preparation that you do counts for that for that dual meet. Looking at the Iowa lineup, I was talking to Tom, Terry, and Coach Morning, Morningstar this past weekend at uh, Midlands, and uh, there's a question mark at 165. Uh, they got Paddock, they got Rhodes, but those are guys I think you can wrestle with right now. Right. How much are you thinking you want to wrestle next year? Yeah, I mean, if they need me, I'll, I'll jump in there. But uh, I I mean, I don't want, I want to listen to what the coaches say because I have no experience with, with that in college wrestling. I have no experience yet. And um, if I go into the room and train for a little bit and I, I think I'm ready, I'm, I'll jump in there. But uh, what Coach Morningstar has to say and what Coach Brands and the, the Brands brothers have to say, then that's, that's what I'm going to do. So. Originally committed to Ohio State, decommitted yeah. to Ohio State, committed to Iowa. Has there been some hard feelings around here, man? No, no. They, all the Graham guys, all the, the Graham family, they, they know I'm Iowa style all the way. And um, I mean, that's just that's just what I've liked. I mean, that's that's where I was growing up. And I mean, Ohio State was in the question. It's always been it's always been there because I'm an Ohio kid. And, but uh, I'm ready to move on to the next chapter and go to Iowa. So. Okay, you're up at 70. You're number one at 160. Willie Saylor's got you number one at 160. Is this a thing that where we could see a Mark Hall, Alex Marinelli matchup? Is that something where we could see that matchup? That'd be nice. I mean, I, I want to see it, but through regular season, I don't think we, we have an opportunity at there's, all. Yeah, I don't yeah, think, I'm not, saying like maybe the spring? Uh, hopefully, yeah, I want to. Yeah, I want to for sure. I've always wanted to wrestle him. And I have a little bit like in Michigan somewhere, some open tournament, but the preparation I'm doing right now, I'm in the heat of the battle. I want to I want to face the guy. I want to face the guys that are above me. So uh, I moved up in weight. I did it for my body. I think it's a lot. I, I'm feeling a lot better during practice. I'm taking guys down a little bit more. And um, I mean, if I can if I can wrestle Mark Hall, he's ranked number one at 170. So that'd be nice. Could we see a 160 anymore? Yeah, you can see. Well, not not during season. Not during season. But you, I'll get. I can get down there. But uh, I just my body's feeling a lot better during one side. And, uh, so state tournament 170. Yeah. All right. You got anything else for me? Nope. All right, man. All right, Congratulations on the big win today. Yeah, thanks.